the governor focusing his time today not only on supply, but also vaccine eligibility for people with comorbidities. We learned today that people with underlying health conditions who make an appointment through the New York State Health Department can begin signing up this coming Sunday for appointments for February 15th and beyond. Now you will need to provide a doctor's letter or sign a certification saying you qualify for the vaccine. If you go to a non state run site like a pharmacy, it's up to the local health departments to determine how, when and where to schedule those appointments. Seven Eyewitness News senior reporter Eileen Buckley has more. Everybody should go into this with their eyes wide open. It's going to be frustrating. It is going to be a crush. That's the warning state leaders are giving people with pre-existing conditions who want to book an appointment starting this Sunday. The state issued a list of more than a dozen pre-existing conditions from cancer to heart conditions to severe obesity that would make New Yorkers 16 years and older eligible for the COVID vaccine. Governor Cuomo says those with pre-existing conditions must show proof. There will be validation of the comorbidity. Uh, people will need to bring a doctor's letter or medical information. Or they will need a signed certification. Cuomo says the federal government failed to order enough vaccine last year. And that's why 10 million New Yorkers are chasing just 300,000 vaccines. Cuomo admits appointments will book quickly. This is going to be uh, a long uh, anxiety producing time. Cuomo Secretary Melissa De Rosa says they have worked to clear up earlier appointment glitches on the state health department's website, but warned it won't be perfect. There are going to be problems that is not going to be perfect and everyone's going to do their best to try to in real time clutch glitches and get things up and up and running, but it's going to be a tough period here. The state says it will be up to local health departments to figure out where and when to schedule appointments at vaccination sites that are not run by the state. A spokesperson for the Erie County Health Department says they are still trying to reschedule appointments canceled in January due to the lack of supply, and that could take several more weeks. But when they are ready, they will follow the state's direction on prioritizing groups. In Buffalo, Eileen Buckley, 7 Eyewitness News.